namna vijana katika kaunti ya Kisii wametoa wito kwa serikali kushughulikia masaibu ya wakenya walioathiriwa na hali ngumu ya kiuchumi. Habari hii na nyingine ni kwenye mseto wa taarifa na mwanahabari wetu Onesmus Musonye. Wakizungumza na wanahabari katika mji wa Kisi, wanaharakati hao walisema wa Kenya wanapaswa kurai uwajibikaji na uwazi kutoka kwa viongozi waliowachagua. Isaac Newton, mwanaharakati wa kutetea haki za kibinadamu, alilalamikia juu ya hali ngumu ya kiuchumi ambayo wa Kenya wengi kutoka nyanja mbalimbali wanaendelea kupitia. Many families are sleeping without meals. Children without school. And all Kenyans are struggling in life to get their basics. No one is being spared. Mothers and their children are suffering. Farmers and their families are suffering. Kwingineko, viongozi wa kidini katika kaunti ya Samburu wameitaka serikali kuchukua hatua dhidi ya walifu na waangaisha wakazi kwenye kaunti hiyo na kuhakikisha amani inapatikana katika maeneo yaliyoathiriwa na ukosefu wa usalama. Aidha ukosefu wa usalama umesababisha shule kufungwa katika maeneo athirika. We are saddened by the fact that in the same trouble areas learning have been paralyzed and schools have been closed like so it was primary school this is sad bearing in mind that junior secondary exam are ongoing our children are suffering many churches have been closed in the same trouble areas wakati wa uo wa kenya walio na watoto wanaoishi na ulemavu wameonywa dhidi ya kuaficha na badala yake kuwasajili katika taasisi zitakazowasaidia Akizungumza katika shule ya kutoa mafunzo maalum ya St. Sylvester Anyiko ya watoto wenye changamoto ya kiakili huko Ugenya, Profesa Julia Ojambo ambaye ni mdhamini wa hazina ya kitaifa ya walemavu nchini alidokeza kuwa inavunja moyo kuona familia kadhaa bado zinawaficha watoto wanaoishi na ulemavu majumbani na pia kuambia misaada iko Sio ya NFDK peke yake, uh -uh. serikali iko na wadhamini ni wengine wako pia wanatoa misaada. Muradi tu wale ambao wanahusika na wale popote na tunawasi wale mavu asifichwe nyuma ya mlango. Hatimaye ni afweni kwa kina mama wa Kajiado Kaskazini na viunga vyake baada ya kukamilika kwa ujenzi wa hospitali ya afya ya uzazi eneo Langong kando na kutoa huduma za uzazi hospitali hiyo ya kisasa inapania kukabiliana na visa vya nasuri pamoja na vifo vya watoto wachanga wakati kina mama wanapojifungua The facilities now that we have in this hospital are truly made it a level for hospital we found this is a small health center Msonye Onesmus, Look Up TV.